Hello everyone. Uh, I'm Dr. Chandrika Makkar, resident in MMI-MSR, Mulana. I'm here to present a paper on malignant peripheral nerve sheet tumors. So here uh, I start with case presentation. A 54-year-old male was admitted to our hospital with left chest wall mass. Patient had complaints of pain on left side of chest with difficulty in breathing. On examination, a well-defined smooth firm mass of approximately 4 into 3 cm was palpable on left side of chest. A patient was then planned for CECT chest followed by biopsy from the lesion. Non-contrast CT images revealed heterogeneously soft tissue density lesion in left pleural cavity posteriorly in lower chest wall uh, which was seen abutting coastal and diaphragmatic pleura. On post-contrast images, uh, the similar lesion showed minimal enhancement uh, and was seen abutting esophagus medially and parietal pleura laterally with no obvious uh, invasion in the chest wall and the fat planes with esophagus were also maintained. There was associated collapse of left lower lobe of lung and uh, few nodules were also seen in costophrenic and cardiophrenic recesses. On PET CT, the similar mass revealed increased FDG uptake. And on biopsy, the microscopic sections showed spindle cell neoplasm consistent with malignant peripheral nerve sheet tumors. And on IHC typing of the tissue, uh, it was negative for CD34, calretinin, S100, SMA, EMA, and P63. Patient was then started with chemotherapy uh, with iphosphamide and adriamycin. Uh, let's have a brief discussion on MPNSTs. MPNSTs are malignant tumors arising from the sheets of peripheral nerve fibers derived from Schwann cells. These are rare, accounting for only 5-10% to 10 of all soft tissue sarcomas. The origin of these tumors is sporadic, which is seen in 40-50 to 50 years age group and also in neurofibromatosis uh, type 1 patients. In, uh, in these patients, the origin can be at, a, at an early age, that is uh, from 28 to, uh, to 36 years. Men and women are equally affected. The main pathogenesis of MPNSTs lies in mutations, uh, which can be seen in patients with NF1. NF1 uh, uh, gene is uh, responsible for production of neurofibromin. Neurofibromin is a negative regulator of RAS MPK. Uh, the mutation in this gene causes uh, pause in the negative regulator, which, uh, which further promotes cell proliferation and uh, leading to MPNSTs. Other mutations can also be seen in CDNK2A gene, TP53, and PRC2. Uh, uh, this tumor shows a rapid increase in size uh, with progressive neurological deficit or pain. Uh, pain is uh, particularly pointed towards the suspected uh, malignant degeneration. During physical examination, special attention should be given to, uh, to examining uh, for the presence of cafe oolate spots, axillary uh, freckling, inguinal freckling, and Lish nodules for neurofibromatosis. On CT, these tumors are usually low attenuating and mildly enhancing. Uh, large, elongated or void masses occurring along a nerve with compression or destruction of adjacent structures and pleural abnormalities indicated malignancy. On MRI, similar lesions are isointense on T1 weighted images hyperintense on T2 with a fusiform shape showing taper dense that is longitudinally oriented in distribution of peripheral nerve. The characteristic features of MPNSTs are large size, necrosis, uh, hemorrhage, heterogeneous enhancement and invasive margins. The differentials of MPNSTs include empyema uh, which can be differentiated as empyema are non-enhancing Patient presents with fever, has raised TLC count, and on aspiration, pus is seen. Uh, other differentials include benign peripheral nerve sheet tumors, 
which are slow growing as compared to empanistes pleural based tumors lung masses consolidation sarcoma are the other differentials on histology empanistes are composed of spindle cells arranged in fascicular perithelomatous and storiform pattern they have marked nuclear pleomorphism vesicular chromatin inconspicuous nucleoli nucleoli mitotic figures and pale less cytoplasm they may show lack of expression of s100 because of de differentiation and occasionally gaping blood vessels myxoid areas and necrosis may also be seen the mainstay of the treatment is surgery with neo adjuvant chemo radiotherapy and studies and trials have revealed doxorubicin plus ifosfamide has has offered best progression free survival however sadly prognosis of this uh, of this uh, tumor is poor and reoccurrence is high thank you so much